show me where it says wear pants on the casino floor. Trevor, Trevor is a... Trevor is a what? Trevor is a good guy. He's like family, I got kid, ain't he, Floyd? That, 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 that's it, right, yes, Trevor. <laughs> but, but, but the thing is, um, I ain't been with that many women. I don't find it easy, and, um, and Deborah, I mean, we're getting married, so... Oh, that's beautiful. But I'm scared that she's gonna leave me. I mean, this is her place, and the fornicating? There's Mr. Raspberry Jail. Whoa. Whoa! Now, Mr. Raspberry Jam, he died a noble death, bringing great joy to a lonely man. I ain't got a very big penis. Some girls laugh when they, when they look at it. Well, oh, show me. Show me, boy! I, 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 I don't want to. Mine ain't nothing special, but this boy gets the job done. All right? Now, Wade here says that you work at the docks. Uh, yes. Look at me! Can you just put your Johnson away, sir? Oh, Jesus. Yes, I work at the docks. And? Anything uh, interesting there for a man like me? Well, I mean, I, I, I don't rightly, rightly know. What kind of person are you? Oh, I'm that kind of person, Floyd. I am that kind of person. Now, let's get you, Wade, and that little tormentor down there to put these on. We are going for a ride. Gentlemen, 
The gateway to America awaits. Run. We got an inside man at the port of LS. I'm gonna send you some information. I need you on point to help plan things. I got it, T. I really miss it. Then, Floyd, what you got for me? Like I said, I don't rightly know what we got. You're going to have to be more exact in your questioning, sir. Uh, we're looking for something to steal. Sir, I stole a pencil in elementary school, and I've been regretting it ever since. Boy, go and plug your stick in the mug. Look, sir, please, just tell me what you want, and I'll do my utmost to assist you in finding it. Here's the problem. I don't know what I want. It's a bit, well, like pornography or a perfect turd. I can't quite describe it, but I'll know it when I see it. You ain't aiding my comprehension. All right, all right. Well, how's this? $236 billion worth of cargo came through the port of Los Santos last year. He's real good with numbers. I don't want to hijack a truck full of pineapples, Floyd. You need to give us the inside track on what's coming through. We don't know what's in the containers. They certainly don't put price tags on them. Have you noticed anything? Anything different? Anything that might indicate something? Well, there's been all these uh, Meriwether folks hanging around. Meriwether Security Consulting. Private army to the New World Order? My butt's gone The folks up. waging outsourced shadow wars in 20 oh, countries around the globe and recently cleared to operate on U.S. soil? That, um, sounds like them. So there's a private militia in the port. What are they guarding? This one freighter? I guess now that you mention it, it ain't quite right. A freighter? Perfect. Can I get on board? No, no. They won't let you anywhere near it. They're kind of assholes about it, actually. The other day, my colleague, Ralph... I don't give a shit about Ralph. We gotta take a look. Is there anything else? There's another bunch of Meriwether guys out by the Navy warehouse. They got boats coming in and out. I heard they was testing something. All right. We'll take a look at that as well. Go park and get to dispatch. No, yep, uh, will do. <laughs> go park and get to dispatch. Come on, shift's about to start. Here comes the suit. I gotta check in. Remember, Floyd, this can go real wrong real quick. He's always drunk. Well, he's particularly drunk. Okay? We got a waste spillage and I got a slot on the cleanup crew. There is nothing that Wade here ain't gonna do for a warm meal. Hope you got a strong stomach, son. <laughs> Get in there. No matter what went in his mouth, it matters what came out. You gonna take me to see this freighter? Yeah, it's over here. You ever got helicopters coming in and out of here? You know, those big sky crane things that can pick up a whole container? Now, this is restricted airspace. Shut they won't up. let anything out of here without clearance. Remember Shoot it down they if they the have room? to. No. So how's a man in a hurry fun. supposed to get in and out of this place? Well, we got a port that's stretched to 50 feet. Now, what's the Coast Guard response like? Well, they got cutters, 45-foot response vessels, air support. You're not gonna move much faster than them, especially if you're carrying something. Maybe I'll have to saddle you up and ride you across the Miriam Turner overpass. I just said they have the water surface real covered. Okay. That is the freighter I told you about. What do you think they got on it? We just stevedore them. We ain't meant to know what's in the containers. But? But these are marked military. Government. Anything weird about that? The government stuff is hot freight. Pulls up, goes right through. This stuff's just been sitting here. You are beginning to arouse my curiosity. Merriweather guys at two o'clock. They're giving Forrest a hard time, all right. 
You! You! We need two guys on the handler. A couple of containers and baby got to be brought up to F. That ain't a question. Get on it. Now! Get up. We gotta do this. How about I run that prick over in this thing? I thought you wanted to scope the place. We don't get the containers, they're gonna check your card. Oh, I'm getting nervous. You're always nervous. Relax. Not always, sir. Just around you. And it's just Cousin Wade's on his own. He better hold it together. Stick to the story. He'll be fine. Boy's on a waste clearance crew. He's never happened when he's neck deep in shit. Please, just don't. It's those containers. Baby! Hook it up! Okay, we got it. Let's take her down to Bay F. I know why they call them handlers. Because they handle like a dream. This ain't a toy, sir. It's heavy machinery. Thank fuck I'm high as a kite. You should not be operating this vehicle while under the influence. I'll operate you under the influence if you're not careful. You happy? Now I'll get the other one for you. Me, anyway. I'm gonna need a better view of that freighter. I'm sorry, but this is as close as you going to get. Nah, nah, nah. I need to take some pictures. Send them to my guy, Ron. I'll need a proper view. There's the cranes, but... Cranes! Perfect! Oh, shoot. So on to us. If my work here is done, I'm going up the gantry. time to admire the view. I've been waiting on a crane driver nearly an hour. I'm not permitted to drive cranes, buddy. Hey, you need me to get your union rep up here right now? Sooner you get in the cab, sooner we can get out of here. This is on you. All right, I'm here. What do I do?
First, you gotta line up the cabin over the container. The lights on the bottom of the spreader will help you position it. Looks like you're in line. You're in position, so drop the spreader down and secure the load. She's there! Lock her on! You got it! Now pick it up so it'll clear the other containers and move it down to the end. Take us to the other end, bay number five. All the way to the end! There's the truck. Set it down gentle. You want to line it up with the frame of the truck. The truck is clear to go. And you said you wasn't qualified. Go back up to the other end and start again. Get back down to the other end. Get in position over the second container in Bay 1. You're done. Break time. Wow. I mean, this is some view, ain't it? I'm gonna take a couple shots for my boy. Trevor, come on. I can take you over to the warehouse. We can use the big rig. It's on the other side of Port City. So they've been guarding one of them dry docks. We can take a look at it, but no one's allowed around there. Normal rules don't apply to us, Floyd. We're going in. I don't know. The rules applied to me my whole life. I like rules. 
And look at you. You're a failure. You're in a loveless relationship. What do you mean? Loveless? I love Deborah. If she loved you, she'd be here, wouldn't she? But she's not. Uh, you know I'm insecure. You've got a dead-end job. What? Dead-end? No. Floyd, it's dead-end. Being a unionized longshoreman's one of the best-paying jobs in the country. You tell people around La Puerta that's what you do, they're liable to rob you. They're so jealous. No one's jealous of you, Floyd. They pity you. You're abused by that woman. You're abused by these slave drivers. I mean, I've never worked so hard in my life. It ain't so bad. Uh, I've been doing this every day for 10 years, only usually with less of the criminality. You're wasting your life. Floyd, it's lucky we turned up when we did. I'm saving you from yourself. We ain't heard from Wade. What are you, his mother? He's fine. The spillage shouldn't take this long to contain. There must be a lot of it. Good. Keep him busy while we get to work. Come through here. It's restricted access. No enciendo. Uh, no understando. Uh, manifesto. Manifesto say deliver here. Mm. Hey, stop. Where the fuck Get do you think you're going? Hey, 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 got confused. Uh, God don't speak English. Uh, must have just read the manifesto. manifesto. He <laughs> said, he <laughs> said, no, he said, Trevor, these photos, you've really stumbled onto something. The ship, Meriwether. Yeah, 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 I know. Tell me about the ship. If we put a man with a gun on the bridge next to it and get a guy on board, I think we got a good chance of taking over. Way it looks to me, there's a container below deck. They're guarding it for the government, keeping it off the books. Serious military technology, most like. Yeah. Of course. I just found a manifest. They're testing something out at sea. It's gotta be that. Now, get back to work. The TPI conglomerate ain't thriving. There's only one man responsible. Of course, yeah. But I'll start pulling all the intel I can get on Meriwether at the same time. I, I got a file here somewhere.
<laughs> what in the name of all things holy? <laughs> I, I, I tried to stop it, but it just kept coming and coming. Oh, it's, <laughs> there, there, Wade. Look, 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 it's a, Betty, you're just not cut out for honest work, all right? <laughs> did, did you get what you needed? Yeah, 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 more or less. Yeah, I just got to uh, figure out a place to plan this now. All right, this will do. That woman ain't even fine. Ain't no one understands why Floyd lets her use him so. Oh, that's uh, low self-esteem, Wade. We got to build him back up. Now. And there, perfect. All right, so based on my observations, I'd say these Merryweather security cocksnots are sitting on something real valuable. I think they got two of these things, but we only need one. First one is on that freighter in a container below deck. They got guards all over that ship, so it's likely they're keeping it on ice. The air, land, and sea routes into the port will be locked down as soon as we make a noise at these X's here. Which means we have to blow up the ship and grab the thing underwater. We need a guy to plant the bombs, a guy to look out for him with a rifle, and a guy to grab the thing, whatever it is, underwater. That means stealing us a submarine, of course, but you can find us one of them, can't you? Huh? Now, the other one is off the coast being tested. They're running the operation from the dock where I last saw your cousin. We'll need a submarine for that too, and probably a chopper, a big one. We go out there, look around underwater, locate it, bring it back here, and find out what it is. Here? To the Congo? Aye, so, what do you think? Container ship or whatever's offshore? It's got to be the container, right? Offshore. Deep sea adventure. Gotta be. You and Floyd can help. We'll get Michael involved and he can put us in touch with some local talent. Tell Floyd to find us a submarine and ask Ron where we can steal a heavy lift chopper. Okay, all right. What is that smell? Oh, we are going straight to the local union rep. Wade here was injured in the performance of his duties. Human waste has seeped into his very pores, and I am sorry to say this, but I don't think he's ever going to smell normal again. <laughs> you can't go to the union. You are union, all right? And you vouched for us, all right? You look at him, man. Smell him. No. Smell him. Uh, Trevor, Trevor, uh, you're, you're planning a robbery on my place of work. You violated Mr. Raspberry Jam, and God alone knows what else. You damaged Deborah. Look, my lady and my union, that's all I got. So why don't we just, uh, why don't we just let this all slide, huh? If you're comfortable with what's happened to your cousin, then so be it, all right? But I would give him a bath and rinse him off. No! No bath! Get the Luca right in there. Like right in. Ah, Trevor. Hey. Mikey, hey, listen. Loving it here in LS. Really settling in. Getting my first enema tomorrow. <laughs> anyway, I heard about some action. Yeah, huh? Yeah, okay. Oh, uh, yeah. 
Now, there's still some prep work and research to do, but it's looking exciting. I'll need you to bring along someone you can trust. All right, bro. I know someone. Hey, talk to Lester. He'll have a good angle on this. Oh, yeah. Oh, and how's your flying? You might need to take a few classes at flight school. Why would I need to do that? Trust me. You'll regret it if you don't. Gonna be just like old times, pal. You're getting wet, Floyd. Take your pants off. This no dairy thing sucks ass. I got you that stuff. Oh, great. Thank you. Where's your wife? Mrs. Thornhill, she's mm -hmm. not my wife. She's got a husband and two lovely kiddies at home. We met online. It's no nothing sexual. Where is she? Well, she's been trying to throw herself under celebs' wheels. <laughs> well, well, she can throw herself under my wheels anytime. Oh, <laughs> I knew you were funny, John. Yeah. I knew. I would like you. C can I have a hug? Okay. Yeah. Uh, hug, yeah. Uh, okay. Come here. Uh, I've got a pr protruding hip. It's not a semi. Nigel! John! No. You won't believe what's happened! What? Only Al Dinapoli walking. He actually walks! He walks walk among, among us. us! Well, then what are you freaks waiting for? Well, that's a long story. Of mistaken identity. And a lot of lies. Stalking is not what I would call it. Oh, me. I told the judge I thought it was unfair. Yes, anyone's trousers could have come undone at that point. Exactly. Jolly bad luck. And we were such fans. Mm. If only we could talk to him. Yes, I know it was only his lawyers and agents. They ruin everything. If we could only get him somewhere private. You see, like that little lockup I know. No problemo. Look, there he is! Oh, shit. It's that crazy English bitch again. Nigel, he remembers me! To the chariot! Jock, you drive! Quick! He's getting away! Come on, Jock, get in! He's taking a left turn down the high street, Jock! Did you ever imagine? 
imagine we might get a private audience with Aldi Napoli? Oh, I'm so oh, sorry. Just a scratch. In my wildest dreams. All those nights spent role-playing in Mother's utility room. If only we'd known. I loved him in the Redeemer. Oh, Nigel, no, we'll never get that deposit back. Do your Algin Eppley line. This is turban warfare, motherfucker. <laughs> it's uncanny. <laughs> oh, dear. Poor Jock must think we're batting. Oh, don't be silly. I hear that behind his charitable... Oh, I won't. Jock, do you see that lorry? What the fuck's a lorry? Have a little faith. Anyone would think this was my first kidnapping. What on earth will we feed the man? I hadn't even thought of that. You probably eat sushi or quinoa. Is that even how you say it? What if he wants meth? Don't get flustered again, Nigel. You'll have another turn. Find out! He's going into the car park. The car park? No worries, mate. Oh, I hope he likes us. How could he not? This lockup you prepared sounds charming. Just be yourself, Mrs. Thornhill. Oh, my giddy aunt! Everything okay there, Earl Crazy Cakes? My prostate has taken quite a beating. You have to lower the tone. Glad to see you on the proper side of the road, dear boy. This must be second nature to you, Jock. All those stunts you used to do. This level of derangement, I'm impressed. Little by little, I'm tip. Is he going through the hospital? Oh my lord! Hold on to your corpses! Uh, seems rude not to follow him through the window. Bloody hell! Ah, uh, would you like me to escort your guest of honor to the trunk? Well, if you don't mind. Oh, come here, you. Come on. Come on. Let me meet your biggest fan. Uh, ah. no. You're fucking crazy. Oh, it's Get Alton off Natalie. me. You're good to go. Ah, a true gentleman. This is so exciting. Nut jobs.
Floyd. I've got that submarine we talked about. You gotta help me store it for a few days. Floyd, don't go quiet on me or I'll come around and I'll, well, we both know what I'm talking about. Okay, um, all right. The, the bring it around to Pier 400 at the Western Docks. On my way. Look. I'm here. Oh, gee. It's around the corner, past the shipyards. Is that sub covered properly? It'll be fine if we just get there. Are you being short with me? No, 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 sir. I'm certainly not being short. I'm just not used to this kind of pressure. 
If you turn a crew onto a score, you gotta be ready for the heat that comes with it. I didn't turn anyone on to anything. You threatened and cajoled and tricked me. You don't want to cut, just walk away. I can't walk away. You're robbing my workplace and running the show from my home. Deborah's home. No cut for you, no cut for Deborah. Drive it under there. You can pull up. You're sure it'll be okay there? Um, sure. All right. If you're wrong, I'll eat your sweet meats. Now get out of here. me!
Oh my god! Ah! No! I persuaded him to change his mind. Oh, you're my hero. I can't thank you enough.
How you doing, Trev? Fine. For a guy who just went into an air base and stole a chopper, are we ready to go on this thing? If it's the heavy lift chopper, then yeah, I'll get everything ready and I'll call you. All right. What is wrong with you smoking in my house? You know, ever since that psychotic pal of yours turned up, you've turned into an even bigger asshole. Thank you. Your support in my difficult times means the world to me. I've supported you. I left everything to come here with you, and still, that crazy bastard turns up. I'll handle it. How? I don't know. Oh, you know what? Just keep him away from me and the children, you low-life, whoremongering asswipe. Did someone say yoga? No, I think she said whore monitoring ass wipe. Hello, Fabian, darling. <laughs> Namaste, Amanda. Are we ready to practice? Yes. Oh, yes, she's very centered. A regular you oasis of peace and tranquility, this with one. anger issues and worse friends. No you... wonder I'm so upset. You too, please. Namaste. We practice. Miguel, join us, please. No, please, no. No, no. The yoga is for sharing. Come, come, Miguel, come. Awesome. Oh. So, Fab, if you can make me as happy and mellow as my wife, it'll be a job well fucking done. We are all on our own journeys, Miguel. Yeah, no doubt. So why is she driving a tank on hers? Perhaps to deal with your hostility, Michael. Now here is good. We have the sun and the Murabunda. The asshole. Now we begin to put the asshole to the earth. Yes, we begin each sequence. Katasana. Yes. Or mountain pose. All right. One, two, three. Mouth and 
Enos are perfectly in line. Show him, Amanda. Un, deux, trois. It is perfect. Now, Michael. through the nose and out the mouth. Let it out, baby. That is okay. In and out with the breath, Mikhail. It's like watching one of my kids take their first steps. Only an old version I resent. Now, in ah. through the bloated nose and out through those wrinkled lips. Ugh. Please don't waste Fabian's time. Lose yourself. You are just one mung bean in the great stool of the Ishta Devata. In the nose, out the mouth. Okay, Doc? Maybe there's hope for him. A small, tiny, minuscule maybe. Air through the nose and out the mouth. Feel all that hostility, insecurity, and self-centeredness drift away. In and out with the breath, Mikhail. Exhale. There. Strong. Like an erection of your youth. This is gonna have to do. Now we will do something more complicated. Sometimes, when I do this pose, I weep uncontrollably for hours. Feel that the emotion inside. Let it go. <laughs> Michael, join us. I feel like I'm channeling bullshit right now. Now, we breathe. Let it out. There! Let it go! The silly man forgets to breathe. Out through the mouth. There. There it is. Breathe, Mikkel. How many years of marriage, and this is the first time he's taken an interest in my hobbies. You can breathe, can't you? Out with the breath. Are you taking this seriously, or is this some elaborate way to get at me? Yeah, I'm about to feel some emotions, all right. Remember, children, do not fear the unknown. We are the unknown. Show us, Amanda. I don't think Michael's up to this. Hmm. He may surprise you. Plank. Plank. Chaturanga. Chata. Yeah. Feel the flow. Mm. Everything is flowing in me. Oh. Mike, would you? Breathing is almost the most important thing, no? Okay. Breathe, please, Michael. Breathe out, please. Good. Take in the air and release it. There. Your lungs, they work, yes? Out through those wrinkled lips. Your aura is just like, wow. Breathing is almost the most important thing, no? If you'd found yoga before, you wouldn't have been that way with coach. Breathe, please, Michael. Out through the mouth. 
Fabian's body with your bank account would be the perfect man. Take in the air and release it. For a meat eater, it's okay. You have come a long way today, Mikael. Huh? Yes, later you will cry like a baby. Yeah, right. His chakras are completely blocked. Don't worry about him. Show me the downward dog. I'm glad we have helped with your impotence, Mikael. What'd you say? Your sexual energies have been blocked for too long. Back into my pelvis. Back, back, back. Yes, there you go. Oh, 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 oh! What? Hey, enough of that! <laughs> Yoga is the answer, Mikael. But what is the question? Uh, why am I such a moron? We are leaving, and we are never coming back. Good. You are alone, you pathetic psychopath. Ugh, fuck you. And that phony French fucking yogi. Ah. Jimmy, you still here? James! Go away! Oh, yeah. Fuck you. You know what? If there was a... It's nice TV. I'm talking that pay for that? Walker. Yeah, you smashed the other one, didn't you? All right, come on. I want to go for a ride. I got to meet a friend. All right, so I'll go meet him with you. Come on, I want to get out of the house. I'm not going alone. Come on. This is fucking bullshit. Bullshit? Threatening to molest your online buddies is bullshit. They're not my buddies. They're the only people you speak to. So where? Where's your friend? Burger shot. Yeah, nice to see the kids are still hanging out at the burger joints. Me and the guys, we'd go down to the diner after class every day. You know, get milkshakes, fries. Ew, please. You know, you're really creeping me out. I'm trying to relate to you. No, you're trying to take me on some nostalgia trip. You're such a cliche. Oh, says the dope-smoking, game-playing, live-at-home world owes him a living millennial. I knew it. I knew fucking shit. I knew it. The mask was gonna slip. The monster's been exposed! The hell are you talking about? The real you! That bitter, vindictive old man! You pretend you're being a father, but you hate me, don't you? I don't hate you, Jim! How many times... I, I love you. Look, I'm sorry if I don't express that correctly, but... Why do you think we're here together? Because you're scared shitless of being alone? You really have to meet my friend? Yeah, hey, I really do. Up. Then please don't get weird. For once in your life, don't be weird. There he is, the friendly neighborhood drug dealer. <coughs> Yo, bro, man, what's man? up? What's up, man? Good to see you. What are you, turning tricks to pay for this shit, huh? Hey, who's the old man? It's my dad. Oh, all right, Mr. DeSanto. <laughs> yeah, you the kid selling Jimmy Pot by the pound? Ooh. <laughs> Ah, Jimmy, bro, you're a dad funny, man. Come on, do this shit and let's get going. Oh, yeah, you, you got that other thing? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Come on, man, what the fuck? Jimmy, just just hold on a second. Oh, all right, all right, later on. Careful with that. Hey, let's bounce. Bounce. We're bouncing now. Is that what we're doing? Jesus fucking Christ. Okay. Oh my God. Watch it, shithead! All righty, then. Now what? Can we just get back to the house, please? So, uh, want a drink? I'm driving. Because normally you're such a between-the-white-lines, friend-to-the-pedestrian kind of guy. Fine. Give it here. Okay, your turn. Maybe when we get home. Ah, who's the squirt? Oh, man! Who's 
us square now. <laughs> I'm starting to feel a little woozy. You're fine. No. Really? This is not normal. You're just paranoid. This is not paranoia. This is totally justified <laughs> concern. You should see yourself. Whoa. Serious. Whoa. No. I'm stopping. Oh, what was in that? It's harmless. Bets have been using it for what? decades. You anesthetize me? You fucking I'm shit. I'm protecting you from yourself. Also, I took money from your bank account and I'm moving what? out. All right? You're too crazy, Dad. Goodbye. Jimmy! Jimmy, you little shit. Hello? Hey! 
I'm home! Anyone here? Kids? I'm back! Michael, I think you finally lost your mind. Your recent behavior and the company you've been keeping already had me very concerned. Now you've taken to attacking my Fabian, who is a close friend, and then Jimmy said you took drugs while driving him in your car. Well, we've decided to move out for a while. You promised me you'd change, and you haven't changed a bit. I know you say I always act like I'm in a movie. Well, this isn't that. I think I'm gonna speak to a lawyer. I'm just really confused. Please, don't try to contact us and try not to get yourself killed. Amanda. Fuck! Tracy, baby, you called? Yeah, look, Dad, we're worried. I'm worried, too. I really want to see you. Well, I don't want to see you. You need help, like serious, serious help. And if you don't get it, you're going to be killed. Tracy, I love you. But you don't know what the fuck you're talking about. I tried, Daddy. That's all I could do.
don't even make sense. Hey. They can save money and just go shopping in their grandparents' closets. And don't even get me started on the fucking users. Hey, what's up? Hey, Michael. David. Well, isn't this nice? You didn't tell me we were double dating. Sorry, guys. This burn hunk of love is all mine. <laughs> Brilliant. Steve Haynes, amigo, but you probably knew that already. Sorry, your name tag must have fallen off. Oh, duh. I love it. I, I, I gotta remember to write that down. <laughs> and to shoot you in your head, you annoying dick. <laughs> Andres, taking notes? This stuff? Whoa. Pure magic. I should put it on my show. Have you seen my show? You mean how to dress like a salesman on a cheap golf weekend at a third-rate country club? <laughs> so, well done with our uh, our friend, Mr. K. My pleasure. Uh, I love helping our government wage war, especially with itself. But you made a mistake. Did I, Cupcake? Why don't you keep your fucking voice down before I close your fucking windpipe? The joke stop now, pal. You will show me and my team some respect. Maybe you could define team for me. Is that just the three of you? Or the greater FIB? Or the entire government? Because I'm tempted to argue that thus far, we haven't shown a lot of your colleagues a whole lot of respect. Then why don't you start with me, genius? You got it, pal. We have received intel that they're keeping Mr. K at the local agency station. I just dealt with that guy. The agency is stepping up their questioning because of your moronic antics down at the coroner's office. We need to get him out of there before he blabs. I did what Agent Norton said. Then I guess you getting involved with a clapped out old agent who's been living off of past glories was your first mistake. You are my boy now, amigo. My career depends on this. And that's very important to me. So seeing as we're all boys now, that makes it important to you. Now run along, kids. See, there you go, Dave. You can teach an old dog new tricks. Let's go. The Bureau owns a lot out in East L.S. Covington supplies off El Rancho. Can you take us there? Yeah, sure. Sounds nice and secluded. Kind of place you'd run an off-the-books operation, huh? So what? So I bet federal ain't on the deed. That's so. And we all like our federal government open and transparent. Except when closed and opaque suits you better. Hey, I'm just a puppet. You're the one pulling the strings. Tell me, Davey, you expense this ride to the taxpayer? Hello. I need you to make a couple of calls. Get some people on board. First guy is Franklin Clinton. Hey, I barely know that kid. He's fixing up my car. Call him, or we'll send some G-men to his aunt's house. Okay. Okay. Michael, this ain't the best time. I'm kind of busy. Hey, sorry about that. Listen, you know that thing we talked about before? It's happening. I need you to come to a lot off El Rancho, not far from where we met before. All right, that's cool. I'm in LS anyway. Now, Trevor Phillips. Oh, you're crazy. I ain't calling him. I thought you might say that, so we had him picked up. That's a dumb move, Dave. Real fucking dumb. Just worry about the plan, okay? Getting Mr. K out of the IAA station. Clinton is going to be positioned across the street, keeping an eye on the proceedings. Phillips flies you in, you rappel down, make the extraction. And I'm the best guy you got for this. With you, we've got good leverage. Great! And you brought Trevor in. We're telling him I'm all cozy with the F5B. You'll need discreet support. We'll maintain control of the situation. Discreet? Control? Yeah, good luck controlling discreet Trevor. Anyway.
what? You better keep a low profile. Yeah, I think I will. See you later. Who's that cagey motherfucker, huh? No, it's another cagey motherfucker, all right? Not you! Hey, T, enough with the faux political bullshit! <sighs> Franklin, come on, you better take off. Really. Shit, I'm good. I ain't bailed. Whoa. What, am I detecting some, uh, some sort of, uh, son I never had bullshit here, Mikey, huh? Hey, listen. If you want to replace some father figure, you can do a lot better than this fat snake, all right? This fucker would eat his own kids. Like I said, Franklin, deranged. Yeah, and best friend. <laughs> exactly. That's Trevor, my best friend. That's Franklin, the son I always wanted. <sighs> all right, guys, listen, this is the shot. I'm gonna do all the heavy lifting on this job, okay? Trevor, all I need you to do is fly me to the target. Franklin, you're gonna cover me from across the street. We're gonna make these assholes happy, and we're gonna walk away from this thing clean. Got it? I got you. All right. And we do this, and they help us bring Brad, right? Yeah. We'll talk about Brad later, all right? I gotta change. You better grab a head start. Nice to meet you, homie. Yeah, whatever. <sighs> The government gimp at last. Eh, yeah, bite me. Let's go. <sighs> All right, let's do this thing. We need to go to the agency headquarters downtown. Your new friends are a riot. No wonder you said sayonara to the old crew. Walking away ain't easy, Trev. Sometimes I guess you gotta make compromises. What happened to dying with a gun in your hand? Life happens. Annoying wife, two kids. Remember them? You get tied down, you can't move anymore. What about your ties to me? To Brad? Those ties are why you got roped in on this FIB instigated suicide pact. For as long as it keeps me amused, I am. The access point is on the west side of the tower. Get us in position so I can repel down. your ass, your tonsils will be playing shadow puppets. You think we can't do that? We can. It's in our guidelines. I don't know what you're talking about. I install cinema equipment, not surveillance. Grab his other arm. No, 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 no. Oh, 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 oh. You think you're impenetrable? See how you feel with this is 18 inches deep inside. Get the loop. Actually, fuck the loop. Who the fuck is this? Terminate him. Close this problem right now. Yeah, I can use a little backup here. Get me the station, Chief. I'm not. 36 flow. I got you. Hey, No! 
know you were a liability, you fucking card! Ha ha ha! Don't get angry, Michael! Do something! That's it! Get us out of here! He's more of a protege. Yeah, what, you gonna teach him to be old before his time? Yeah, to never grow up. That seems like a good kid. Huh? Michael, uh, look at this, huh? New city, new set of problems, but the idiots, uh, they stay the same. Yep, I guess. All right, Trevor, I'll see you later. Oh, you better believe it, buddy. I'm going, man, before you take advantage.
Don't you step foot in this yard. Why? It's half my house. Now, I'm going to call the police. For what? Disloyalty, boy. Disloyalty? What is you talking about? Don't act like you don't know what it is, homeboy. Yo, you ain't been to the set, ain't came to none of the meetings. Mm, hanging out with old men, ignoring your homies, oh. acting all superior. Your mama will turn over in her grave, boy. Mm -hmm. So you giving me a lecture about not being a good enough gangbanger. Gangs is positive. That's all we got, my nigga. That's our heritage. Ain't nothing positive about your crazy ass. Man, where Tanisha at? She got more sense than to hang out with your sorry ass. You know you always been like this, boy. I say left, you say right. I say become a doctor. You say become a patient. I say, who is that? Hello, Missy. Wow, Franklin. You never told me that you had a sister. I'm Denise, Franklin's housemate. And aunt, my mother's old dried up ass Shut sister. the fuck up. Yeah, shut the fuck up. Here, darling. Why don't you go get yourself something nice, OK? Oh, thank you. <laughs> is, is it $7? I said something nice, not expensive. You want to be a greedy fucking cow, huh? No. Now get the fuck out of here, all right? You men are all the same. Man, what the fuck you doing here? Here with the boy. The boys. What? I'm fucking new in town. I'm making friends, all right? Now let's party. Look, I had plans on getting some rest until this clown and my aunt came and fucked that up. My nigga, I just came over here to holler at you about the little thing. Man, I said I'm tired, dawg. What fucking thing? I love things. I'm the king of things. I ain't talking to you, homie. Hey, let's go do something about the thing, okay? What thing? I'm talking about the little stretch thing, man. Fucking beautiful. Perfect. It's a gangbang. Let's go. Come on. Come on, Who is this man? man? What is this Man, just from, come man? on. Happening down Grove Street. We shooting shit up, spraying some motherfuckers. I can drive by with the best of them. Behave yourself, man. Lamar, what's happening? What you and stress set up? We buying weight, homie. Something that'll move us up the food chain, nigga. For real. Not this real in this town, nigga. Particularly where you and stress concerned. Man, this is an investment opportunity. You got to speculate to accumulate. Ooh, first rule of business. Hey, since we're out here banging, either you got some dust. Fool want to get butt naked? <laughs> I'll get whatever it takes me, homeboy. Homie's crazy, man. <laughs> so I've heard. This the homie house right here. Hey, look, everybody be cool, man. Lamar about to do his thing, all right? Get the fuck out of here. Piece of shit. My young homie just kicked me down the grip. We big ball. I mean, what can you say? Hey, be on point, this fool janky. Courier service. Packets to collect. You got the grip? Present and accounted for. <laughs> you like that, huh? Sample. <laughs> now we talking. <laughs> My throat getting numb already. So we good, nigga, right? Well, let's go. How about a taste? No, man, we leaving. I want a taste of the other side of the brick. Now you heard what your boy said, you're leaving. Hey, give me that. Give me that. Whoa. What the fuck? Did we ask for a key or a fucking ounce? Man, that's motherfucking drywall. Hey, we got some motherfucking buyer's remorse out here. Damn, you can't fucking hustle a hustler. Fuck off. Ah. Oh, you motherfuckers are dead. Oh, Street, like that. We got the Fuck. Hey, fuck the fan. We on foot now. Run, shot, run. Get the fuck out of here. Nigga, we look like jumps to you. We bump these fools. Let's move. Just get that. Lame ass. Hey, we out of here. Oh, 
Another time, they got sea start racing. 